Today, I'm going to be answering your questions so you can get to know me better. Am I married? How old am I? Do I have any pets? What's my favorite video game? How much money do I make on YouTube? I'm going to be answering all of your questions right here. All of these questions were submitted by you guys on the Alie Reacts Facebook page. Be sure to go ahead and check it out in the description. Follow the page for exclusive reaction videos and pictures that you don't get anywhere else on social media. And thank you to everyone that gave me a question. Fortnite or Call of Duty? You've got to pick one. I love both of these video games. I don't know. I think we have to go Fortnite. What PC specs do you have? I'll throw them up on the screen here. Could you do more videos with Claire? You're a very cute couple. Thank you so much. I definitely want to do more videos with Claire. We reacted to some world records recently. You guys love it. So give this video a thumbs up if you want to see Claire in more of my videos. Hey, Ali, I'm a big fan. I wanted to know why you don't stream on Twitch. Please answer me. I don't stream. Just got to have enough time in the day. I love making videos and cutting them down, sharing them with you guys. Streaming will take up so much of my time. I couldn't do anything else, unfortunately. I wish I could stream. Maybe I'll do it in the future, but not right yet. Hey, Ali, I love your videos. I just want to let you know that you're an amazing person. I've unfortunately been dealing with depression, but your videos put a smile on your face. I know it's not a question. I just want to say thank you so much. And if these videos make you feel better every day, then I'm happy. If you didn't do YouTube, what job would you be doing? Oh my gosh. I always think about this. I think I'd be something boring, like a banker maybe. I really like numbers. YouTube's got a lot to do with numbers, with views, likes, subscriptions. And I think that's why I really got into it. But what else would I be doing? Definitely nothing as cool as being a YouTuber. I'm very lucky. What is your favorite sport? It's a really good question. I love tennis as a kid. I never really followed football, but recently I've gotten really into golf. It was actually my birthday on November the 6th and Claire got me some golf clubs. So I'm going to be playing a lot more golf recently. And thank you to all of you guys for incredible birthday messages. I'll be posting a special birthday post on the Ali A Reacts Facebook page. So don't forget to follow. What made me want to follow the path of being a YouTuber? And do I still love it to today? Maybe a lot of you guys want to become a YouTuber as well. P.S. You're better at Fortnite using Epic Games yourself. Thank you so much. Uh, well, when I started YouTube, it was 12 years ago. Some of you may have been watching me for the very first time or for many, many years. But I started when I was about 14 or 15 years old. With it being my birthday yesterday, I am now 28 years old. I'm getting old, people. But nobody made any money from YouTube back when I started uploading. I just wanted to share my favorite video game clips with my friends. And YouTube was a great place to upload that. And since then, I've very, very slowly grown a following through gaming, making videos, and it's been amazing. If you're watching right now and you want to make any YouTube videos, do it because you really enjoy it, you love it, and most of all, you have fun. Because if it does take off, you want to still be doing the things that you enjoy as a bigger YouTuber. And I'm sure one of you watching this video right now will one day be a big YouTuber as well. Let me just say, I've been watching your videos since you started Minecraft and I absolutely loved it. Oh my gosh, that was years ago. Will you ever be playing Minecraft anymore? What do you guys reckon? I haven't played Minecraft in a while. I love to react to awesome Minecraft videos. Should I play myself? P.S. When are you and Claire getting married? Well, if you guys didn't know, myself and Claire have been engaged for two and a half years now. And finally, a few weeks ago, we got married. Here's some pictures on screen. I also shared, again, some pictures on Ali A Reacts. So make sure you've hit the follow button. And it was an utterly incredible weekend with friends, family. So I can now say that I am a husband. Claire is my wife and it makes me so, so happy. And I'm glad that you guys have seen me and Claire grow as a couple over the six years that we've been together. Would you ever think about starting your own family? I love the vid, especially Fortnite story. Thank you so much. Yes, definitely. I think Claire and I definitely want to start a family. If you didn't know, we've already got a family. We've got two cats, Oliver and Darcy. They are giant cats. Two dogs, Evie and Lexi. They're actually smaller than the cats and we love them all so much. But to add some kids into there as well could be happening at some point in the future. We're not going to rush anything, but I'm sure it'll happen one day. What do you do besides making or editing videos on YouTube? It's a very good question. I'm working on some huge projects behind the scenes. One of them got to do with actually you guys potentially becoming bigger YouTubers as well, but I can't say any more than that. I'm always looking to bring people into my team to help me make these videos, edit them, come up with ideas, and that takes a lot of my time. If an outside of work, I like to hang out with Claire, go on dog walks, see my friends and hang out and try not be at my PC all day. If you had to pick between deleting Fortnite or deleting your YouTube channel, which would you delete? Oh my gosh, I think it's safe to say I would delete Fortnite. Well, technically I could reinstall Fortnite, but if I had to delete one of them forever, I would leave Fortnite alone because I love my YouTube channel. I could potentially move on to another game or still upload videos for you guys in vlog form, but there's no way I could delete my channel. That would be too sad. I couldn't do it. Talking of YouTube, actually, I've just upgraded my background. All of these silver plaques are for 100,000 subscribers. All of the golden plaques are for a million subscribers. And this one right here is for 10 million subscribers. Let me show you. It's very, very heavy. This right here is what you get for 10 million. I got it from my main channel, Ali A, which is at 17 million. This channel is at 7 million. If you watch right now and you haven't already, please subscribe because I'm trying to hit 10 million on this channel so I can have two of these. Not many people in the world can say they've got two of these and I want to do it. What is the best Pokemon card you've ever pulled? Oh my gosh, I love opening Pokemon cards. I've actually got the new 
year celebration Pokemon cards. I think I'm going to open them on his channel very soon. The best card I own, I didn't pull, but I did buy. This is my secret collection of Pokemon cards. This one right here is a PSA 10 Shining Charizard. There's only about 100 of them in the whole world, and they came out years and years ago, and I bought it and completed the collection as a fun little project. Definitely my rarest cards. What would you choose to be the best Fortnite player ever that existed and have the best locker of Fortnite skins or get 50 million play button? Does that mean 50 million subscribers? Because I'm telling you, I would take 50 million subscribers. That would be incredible. Can you do a more in-depth room tour once your room is finished? Yes, I've actually put up a lot of the extra shelves. You can see I've got darker shelves now. I've got more play buttons. I still want to finish it off and make it super tidy. I've got a new desk coming as well. As soon as it's ready, I'll do a tour for you guys. Do not worry. Make sure you subscribe to see it. What is your favorite Pokemon? I always love Gengar, but we do have a dog named Eevee literally after the Pokemon Eevee. So I think Claire's would be Eevee. Mine would be Gengar. Two questions. Where did you get the name Allie? And if you could bring one point of interest back from the chapter one map, what would it be? Well, I got the name Allie because my first name's Alistair. It's actually A-L-A. -A. Some people spell Alistair A. L I. My mum called me A-L-A -A Alistair so that people wouldn't call me Ali, but I ended up being called Ali and my second name starts with A, so I call myself Ali A. So actually, it's based on my real name. And if I could bring one point of interest back from the chapter one map, I'd have to say... Tilted Towers? I think everyone would want to see Tilted Towers, right? Hey, Ali A, code Ali A in the item shop. That's right, you can use code Ali A in the Fortnite item shop, Call of Duty item shop. All of you guys that do that support me massively, so thank you so much. Would you ever play with me or fans? Sometimes from the Ali A Discord, which you can join again in the description, I'll get you guys into a big game and we'll play together for videos. So I do do that from time to time to join the Discord for a chance for you to play with me. Ten years ago, did you ever imagine being this big on YouTube or even getting married? Absolutely not. As I said, when I started YouTube, no one made money from YouTube at all. No one ever knows knows what's going to happen in the future. I don't know what's going to happen in five years or 10 years. Will I still be doing YouTube? Maybe. And maybe one of you guys will be as big as me on YouTube. There is a possibility that that will happen. What is your dream car and what is your dream house? Oh my gosh, I absolutely love cars. If you didn't know, we have a Tesla Model X P100D, the fastest version. And I also have an Audi R8. I absolutely love both of them. They're both very fast and very cool cars. If I could get a dream car... I don't know, maybe a Lamborghini or a Ferrari, a Bugatti, but they're so expensive. I don't know. I love the cars that I've got at the moment. What's your favorite cars? Let me know in the comments. The house we're in at the moment is incredible. We've just had an extension. I feel very fortunate to be living in this house. I'm very blessed. I would love to have a house somewhere else in the world, somewhere really hot, like Spain or Australia, and then have two houses so you could go between both of them and always be in a place where it's really hot and sunny. That'd be awesome. Are you getting a Fortnite skin ever? Oh my gosh. I wish. I really, really hope, maybe, fingers crossed, touch wood, that I maybe one day get a Fortnite skin. Icon skins are incredibly rare. I think there's only five content creators that have ever got one so far. To ever be picked to get one in the future would be the biggest honor in the world. But look, if it doesn't happen, it doesn't happen. I'll just have to keep on grinding Fortnite. You'll have to stick around to find out. Big one, wife or Fortnite? Oh my gosh, that is a tough choice. Nah, I definitely go with Claire, my wife. Do not worry. But hopefully I don't have to pick the between the two. What is your greatest fear? Keep up the good work. Thank you so much. Oh my gosh. I don't like heights. I think the idea of just losing everything I've built across all my YouTube channels would be utterly awful. So I keep on working hard to make sure that doesn't happen. I don't know. I try not think about the bad things or my fears. I try and always focus on the good things, the goals that I want to try and achieve. And if you guys do that, focus on the positive stuff. I think it's a good way to live your life. What's your favorite skin this world record plaque? If you didn't know, I actually have, I think, about six or seven world records. I found them the other day. They're in the garage downstairs. Maybe I should include them in my setup tour. Some of them are for having the biggest Call of Duty channel. I did some Minecraft gaming challenges. Honestly, to have even one Guinness World Record is incredible. So I feel very, very blessed to have the multiple Guinness World Records that I do. Although some of them have been beaten now, but don't tell anyone. When will we see another video on the Claire and Ali channel? Also with the dogs. Oh my gosh, I know. Myself and Claire launched a channel, if you didn't know, where we post videos together. We wanted to do one a week, and then we both got really busy. Claire started streaming, I started to launch new channels, and the Claire and Ali channel has kind of fallen to the side. There's a chance we may go back to vlogging a lot more on that channel if we decide to travel a little bit more and have some cool ideas. But I apologize that channel hasn't had videos in a long time. We still love you guys. And if you subscribed, thank you so much. What would be the one game crossover that you'd love to see happen? Oh my gosh, that's crazy. Well, if it's Fortnite, I'd love to see something Nintendo or maybe something Pokemon crossover with Fortnite. That would be insane. If I saw myself crossover with Fortnite, that would be even more insane. I love loads of games. And the cool thing is all of these games seem to be coming together and putting each other in their games like Smash Bros, for example. Recently had a Disney character 
character from Kingdom Hearts has had Minecraft put in it. I was kind of hoping that Jonesy from Fortnite would go into Smash Bros. That'd be crazy. So there is a chance of all of these crazy collaborations happening in the future. Fingers crossed. How long have you had that hat for? It feels like you've had it for ages. Well, it's actually my own official alley hat. You see, I've got my merch hoodie on as well. I launched my merch last year, actually. It's been going for one whole year. We've got some really cool Christmas stuff coming up at alley.shop. We've got school stuff, clothes, tons of awesome products. You guys have supported it a lot over the last year, so thank you so much. And look out for a lot more stuff coming soon as well. What's your favorite thing about being a content creator? Is it hard to run multiple channels? Yes, it's not easy to run a lot of channels, which is why Claire and Ali doesn't see too many videos at the moment. My tip for anyone that is running a YouTube channel, as long as you've got the channel that you're running doing really well and in a good rhythm and you've got some spare time, then you can launch another. I've only ever launched extra channels when I've had extra time and decided that would have a lot of fun running the new channels, which is why I've got a COD channel, this channel, Fortnite channel, channel with Claire and Ali. My favorite thing about being a content creator is all the incredible opportunities. I get to travel around the world. I've been to New York, Iceland, Los Angeles, all over Europe, some incredible trips, meeting some incredible people because of my job. How tall are you if you didn't know? I'm actually very tall. I'm actually six foot three. So when people meet me, the number one thing everyone says is, wow, you're so tall. Because you have no idea how tall I am when you just see me on camera like this. Oh, this is a good question. Will there be a wedding video on Claire and Ali like the proposal vid? We did actually get uh, a team of guys to film the wedding. We haven't seen it yet. It hasn't been edited. But we did ask them for a longer version that could potentially go on YouTube. We're not sure yet. I think it will go on our joint channel. We really enjoy the video and feel like it's going to work well on YouTube and we want to share it with you guys, we will. So look out for that. There's a chance we will upload the wedding video for you guys. Oh, have you ever thought of quitting YouTube? I have. I've actually almost quit YouTube multiple times. I've done YouTube for 12 years. Not many people are lucky enough to stay as a big YouTuber for that long. They have periods where they do insanely well and then it slows right down. And when it slows down after being so big, it's not easy to stay motivated and stay positive. I've had years where Call of Duty is doing bad, Pokemon Go was doing bad, Bad, and then Fortnite's doing bad, but I luckily now can power through it. However, in the past, I've definitely considered quitting and doing something else, but I haven't. I'm still here, and I'm going to keep on making videos. Thank you so much, everyone, for your questions. You're all amazing. Don't forget, go and follow me at Ali A Reacts on Facebook. Click that follow button. I'll be uploading exclusive videos and pictures that you'll only get over there, so don't miss out. Or you can click on screen here to check out more videos. I'll see you over there, guys. Thanks for watching.